Hey guys, this is Encanto. Watched a lot of hard movies lately. I think it's time for some uh, pleasantness. But in our darkest moment, we were given a miracle. The candle became a magical flame that could never go out. And it blessed us with a refuge in which to live. Yeah, nice. A place of wonder. And a house just popped up itself came alive to shelter us damn that's some good service the miracle blessed each with a magic gift to help us and when their children came of age they got magic too <laughs> that's right tonight this candle will give you your gift mi vida Cool. Strengthen our community. Strengthen our home. What gift happened? My cousin's ceremony is tonight. What is it? We're gonna find out. What's your gift? So the whole town knows they have powers and magic. Okay, I've never edited a musical, so I don't know if this is going to be a huge issue while editing and uploading copyright issues. So I'm just going to turn it really low. Oh, cool. Why? Shit. Oh. It's just the Madrigal family that has magic. <laughs> yeah, how am I gonna memorize all the characters? Wow, that's a lot of colors. What's your gift? Oh, she's not gonna have a gift. I like the one with the weather, mood weather thing. Or the shapeshifter? Oh, damn. <sighs> She's a squib. Damn, that sucks. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> okay, so the end of the movie, she's going to discover that her gift is on the inside. <laughs> oh my god. 
Don't be a bitch, though. Mm. Surrounded by the exceptional, it was easy to feel unceptional. Okay, oh my god, when I was at school, a bee stung me, PE class, my ear was exactly like that. No joke. I fucking hate bees. It was exactly like that. I was like playing with it. No. The whole town relies on our family, on our gifts. So the best way for some of us to help is to step aside. Peppa, you have a cloud. <laughs> I know, Mama, but now I can't for Antonio. What do you want from me? <laughs> <laughs> She's my favorite. Everyone's looking for you. But what does he look like in real life? I mean, what's his actual shape? I once saw a movie or a TV show where there was a shapeshifter and they shapeshifted so much that they, they, that they forgot what they actually looked like, which is really scary. <laughs> well, he asked her. He speaks to animals! That's so cool! Of course they can come! Oh, that's so amazing! Okay, I want that and the weather together. The weather power and the talking to animals. Oh, so the house creates a new room for him. Damn the what's her name? Forgot her name. Uh, Maribel lives in the nursery still. And this guy gets this place? Shit! Yeah! Whoa, so no animal can hurt him? Oh, that's amazing. 
Yeah, definitely this and the we mood weather. Oh, that's... Yeah, I'm so jealous. I knew you could do it. A gift just as special as you. Do the men that marry in get powers too? I'm guessing not, but if they're in the picture, let her be in the picture too. Maybe her powers are delayed or something. Like delayed puberty. She can't do anything for you, unfortunately. Yo. Yeah, damn. Doesn't call someone. Shit. Shit. Eternal fire, man. What happened? Shit, you guys. No one can feel it? Whoa, she hallucinated? Shit, her power is destruction. I'm not a fan of people telling people they're special just because it's okay to be not special too. <laughs> it's okay to be normal. There's nothing wrong with that. Shit, her her power is destruction. I know it. And what happened to Bruno? I need you. Cracks in our casita. Okay. Why did you like deny it? Why is this happening? Don't touch it, man. Cousin, so I feel like I can talk to you about anything. Ergo, you can talk to me about anything. Like the problem with the magic last night that no one seemed to worry about, but maybe you heard about that maybe I should know about. Camilo, stop pretending you're Dolores so you can have seconds. <laughs> <laughs> the only one worried about the magic is you. And the rats talking in the walls. Oh, and Lisa. I heard her eye twitching. Oh my. Shit. Dolores says you're totally free. Can't you remember something about last night with the magic? Yeah, we know it. If you can't pay attention, I will follow you. Actually, as I was saying, we must never take a for granted. So today we will work 
I've spoken to the Guzmans about Mariano's proposal to Isabella. Dolores, do we have a date? Tonight. He wants five babies. Something, Lisa. If you know what's hurting the magic, and it gets worse, cause you won't tell me what's wrong. Nothing's wrong. Wow. Uh, sorry. That uh, that smug out there. What I meant was, uh, why would anything be wrong? I'm totally fine. Matt's fine. Lisa's fine. I'm totally not nervous. <laughs> Your eyes. Yo, hmm. What was in his vision? No one knows. They never found it. But if something's wrong with the magic... Start with Bruno's tower. Find they never vision. found the vision. Wait, you find the vision. Yeah. What am I even looking for? Uh, if you find it, you'll know. Wow, that's Here. helpful. Okay, an hourglass. So he has... His... Power has to do with time. So cool, every room has its own world. I once went down 495 stairs and had to go up 495 stairs. It was a nightmare. It was at Mons Clint in Denmark. Ah. Okay. No! Good job. <laughs> oh shit. I think Bruno got stuck in this world. He couldn't come out. And then she's supposed to help him come out to save the magic. Uh oh. But she's trying to fix it. Yes, get them all. Come on, yellow. Shit. Whoa. I'm losing my gift. What? Mirabella what? and I were having this little talk about me carrying too much, so I tried not to carry so much, but I realized it was putting me behind, and I knew I was going to let everyone down, and I felt really bad, so I was grabbing all the donkeys. Stay away from Luisa until I can talk to her. Tonight, we can't have any more problems. And whatever you're doing, stop doing it. Thank you, Madam Fibri. 
Well, it's not his fault. Stop asking him questions about what's gonna happen to you in the future. She's gonna, she is the reason of the magic getting fucked. Disaster. <laughs> Do a perfect night. Salud. Salud. <laughs> what if she breaks eye contact? She's gonna tell. Yeah, the rats are gonna take you right to Bruno. Follow them. Dio. Okay, yeah, that was funny. Why did you take the vision? Oh, he has OCD. Have you been in here patching the cracks? Oh, that? No, 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 no. I'm too scared to go near those things. All the patching's done by Hernando. Who is Hernando? I'm Hernando, and I'm scared of nothing. <laughs> How long have you been back here? You never left. I don't <laughs> understand why you left but didn't leave. Oh, well, because, you know, the mountains around the Encanto are uh, pretty tall and, uh, well, you know, like I said, free food and everything. <laughs> Damn, that's sad. Someone banished him. He didn't leave. I'm sure of it. I think, I think that grandma banished him. I had this vision the night that you didn't get your gift. Our house breaking. And then I saw you. The vision was different. It, it would change. And, and there was no one answer. No clear fate, like your future was undecided. But I knew how it was gonna look. I knew what everyone would think because I'm Bruno and everyone always assumes the worst, so. So. You. Ah! Your wish you could have seen more, so see more. Have another vision! 
Oh, uh, no, no, see, I, I don't do visions anymore. But you could. But I won't. You can't say the weight of the world is on your shoulders. The end. If our face of three Nisa's have another vision, oh. maybe they'll show me what to do. Because I need a big open space. We'll find one. Where? Isabella do anything. I don't know. Our family got a miracle. How do you help a family miracle? You have your sister. Uh, we love it. <laughs> Get out. Everything was perfect. Abuela was happy. The family was happy. You want to be a better sister? Apologize for ruining my life. So she was, so it's a good thing. Is that cactus like a pimple or something? An imperfect thing in this perfect room? So she didn't want to ma get married to that guy. So that's a good thing. Okay, she doesn't want to be perfect, okay. Got it. Oh my god. Oh, there we go. Rat started with you. Bruno left because of you. Luis is losing her powers. Isabella is out of control because of you. I don't Shit. know why you weren't given a gift, but it is not an excuse for you to hurt this puppy. Bruno left our family because you only saw the worst in Bruno him. Bruno didn't care about this family. He loves this family. I love this family. It's going to burn the house down. Ah! Damn, even the mountains in the back. So literally everything that the candle created, I thought it was just symbolic, but it actually created all the, like the whole place. Casita died too. Sorry. 
Don't apologize. It's not your fault. It's her fault. Whoa, dude. I want to know what country this is. I want to know what this conflict is. Like, where is this? Where did this migration... I'm, I'm guessing this is like a real... Like some real historical shit. And I was so afraid to lose it. And I am so sorry. I don't get it. What she withheld? Withheld her power or something? Oh, you need to cut on the coffee, man. So her gift is bringing them together after they lose their magic. Whoa. She's gonna be the next abuela. Oh my god, what if she has all of the powers? Nice. But they have to tell us what her power is, come on. So she doesn't have a power? I need some explanation. It's a fucking kids movie. Why is it this hard? Or am I that big of a dumbass? So does she have a power or not? Cause she touched the doorknob and the whole house came back and all the other people's powers came back. So her power was to bring them back what about her? Does she get anything? Okay. 
It was really co colorful. I liked all the colors and stuff. That was enjoyable. Uh, didn't care too much for the songs. Maybe just the first one. I liked Bruno. Um, and the bird. <laughs>